today I'm going to be doing a video. Um, this is actually a number three of teaching how to do a handstand, but there's going to be more to it. I'm so sorry, this is not clickbait. If you think this is clickbait, it's not clickbait, but there's more to it. So, let's get into it. This is going to be like an even better. It's like the same thing, but it's going to be even better. So, let's go. So, first thing you're going to do is put your head on. Your head down. Put your hands on the side of your head. And then lift. Down lift your body. You've got to check your surroundings. So, that you know if there's nothing in your way. Oh my gosh. But there we go. There's number one. And then here are the other things I'm going to be teaching you how to do. Oh my gosh. I'm going to do them again. So I don't know if you guys hold it on. So there you go. One hand cartwheel, a regular cartwheel, and whatever this is. Let me show you what this is. Whatever this is called. I'm not even sure what it's called, but I know that it's something in life. So let's get straight into it. So. First, what you're going to need to do on your one hand handstand, you're going to need to make sure that your hand is strong enough to put your whole body over. So I'm going to need you to um to do the um the um handstand first, and if you can't do that with your whole body just on your head and your hands, then you need to start training. So, um, you can't do that if that's so the people who are more strong enough to put your hands in the bottom of your hands like that, and then probably put your hands like that. What do you want the cartwheel next? This is the cartwheel. Put your hands on the and toss your body over it. And the next one, whatever that's called again, like I told you, I don't, I just know that it exists. And you have to go like this. Like this. And then you have to, you have to put your hand on the ground and launch your, your body over it. And there you have it. Bye, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Bye.